I'm Katie. And I'm Steven with pdq.com. We're here to talk to you about submitting a ticket. So there's three different ways that you can submit a ticket. The first and most basic one is through email. If you just send an email to support at pdq.com, it'll go to us and we can help you out. Yes. Other way, you can visit our wonderful support page, which you will find at support.pdq.com or by visiting pdq.com and clicking on support in the top left-hand corner. Mm -hmm. So you can see I, I went to support.pdq.com. Um, in, in the top right corner, it says sign in. So I signed in. And then you can click on your tickets. And that will bring you to your tickets page. So if you've already submitted tickets, you can look at them here and see the status and stuff. And to do a new one. Hit that pretty blue button. Submit a ticket. Right there. Fill out the subject description, product, obviously. Mm -hmm. And also, very important, the version number, the whole yeah. version number. Mm -hmm. If you give us latest or 16, just something generic, mm -hmm. we'll probably be asking you anyway for the whole version number at some point. Sometimes we have a, a newer version that hasn't been publicly released that maybe fixes the problem that you're having. So the full version helps us know if you already have that new build. And our favorite thing, screenshots. If you see what's broken, show us. Mm -hmm. Show us all the screenshots. We we get excited when we see lots this of screenshots. attachments. So wonderful. Yeah, make sure you do lots of attachments if if they're relevant. Totally. Yeah. And then the last thing that we're going to talk about is some other things that help us help you, since you you've probably done troubleshooting with end users and mm -hmm. know how fun it is to hear something vague like my computer is slow. Yeah, like, it's broken. Tell me more. Help me now. So if you can tell us, you know, what you were doing when you ran into the problem or the error message. Mm -hmm. If you can reproduce it, if it uh, broke at a certain point while you were doing something. Mm -hmm. Let us know what you've already tried. If you've already tried like the basic stuff, rebooting, let us know so we don't ask you to do it again. Yeah, I mean, a lot of, a lot of back and forth can get cut out if it turns mm -hmm. out it's an issue that you need to reboot. Have you tried rebooting? Yeah. The next way to submit a ticket is when you run into an error message in the program. Uh, you're going to be greeted by one of these boxes or maybe a... A stack trace with a little smiley, or a, well, he's not smiling, a little frowny face. Yeah. So, a window will pop up with an error. Yeah. A window will pop up, and you'll know the window because it'll have a button somewhere about in the middle that says, Sub submit this issue to PDQ support. That's us. Mm -hmm. So click on that. It'll show you the whole, all the details yep. that, that this little guy, send to us. You'll see what's in here. One important thing to note is this email address box. If you're just firing off a, a, a stack trace because you wanted to let us know about an error message that you found, cool. We'll send it over to development and make them look at it. Uh, if you want to hear back from us, like you have a problem and you can't open deploy, include your email address and a description up here so that we know what's broken, what you've tried. Yeah, what triggered this error, yeah. stuff like that. But the email address is important because if you don't mm -hmm. put an email address, we have no way to get back to you and mm -hmm. we'll just have to sadly close the ticket and be yeah. like, well, sir, you're so close yet so far. Yeah. So, and then obviously send the report and it'll find its way to us and we'll take a we'll look, email you back and get it fixed. Also, one thing to note, um, if you are watching a YouTube tutorial or uh, maybe a blog post or something like that and you have a technical question, the best way to get in contact with, with us is through a support ticket, either through the email or through the support site. Um, instead of leaving a comment, it's just always best to contact support directly. Yeah, and that's that's submitting a ticket. So send them off to us. Yep. We do tickets and- We'll help you out. Yeah, we'll talk to you soon.